Roger Real Deep Cool, what is going on? How is your boy? What y'all doing? What y'all up to? I ain't doing that, man. I'm just chilling. You know what I mean? I'm just doing a little something, something here and there to and fro. You know what I'm saying? But right now, I'll be ready to, uh, I don't know. I got to feel them open up a box, though. I'm opening up a box. I don't know what's in the box. I wasn't even expecting this box, but I'm opening up the box. So let's get the key. In the wrong side. I'm going to open up the vault. Unlock it. Pull it open. Come on in. What's up? Yo, let's get right to it. Because I don't have all night. I got stuff I got to do. Taste some orange juice. Non-alcoholic orange juice. Got that official CD playing back in the background right there. The name of that song is called Hurry Up. Little Latin vibe. Sometimes I like I like putting Latin vibe songs on my CDs. So that's like a little Latin vibe thing going on right there. Holla at you. Boy, what? Talk to me about it. Tell me about it. We ain't listen to it, all right? In the meantime, I want to talk about Gerlans. Uh, I think it's called uh, Oriental Brew Launch. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. If you like sweet gourmands, which I do, because I own a couple of Gourland's sweetest pieces. One being Gourmand Coquine, which is cocoa and more cocoa and some other stuff in it. Then I have Angelique Noir, which are berries and some other sweet stuff in it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This Oriental Brulant will be made for women, of course, made for women. Forget it. You can you can pull it off easily. Let me tell you why you can pull it off. Because though it has vanilla, tangerine, tonka. What else are they having in it? Vanilla, tangerine, tonka, styrax. Can't remember. Alright, so when you first spray it on, if you're familiar with Love by Killian, you get that vibe. You get that kind of vibe. Probably because of the tangerine. Maybe because of the tangerine and the vanilla. I mean, uh, now, now, of course, Love doesn't have tangerine in it, but it does have vanilla in it. But vanilla is not really overbearingly strong. It's like the vanilla is there just to give it the sweetness and the tangerine. You don't really smell the tangerine like a fruity tangerine. You don't really smell that in Oreo and Blunt. That's not what you smell. This thing, the composition and how it's composed is what makes this magical. What takes it from definitely being a woman's fragrance to being a unisex. Dude can pull this off all day. I'm telling you. I'm trying to tell you. Oriental Brulant by Galan, you got to get it. What happens lasts on me all day today. All day. Spray it on this morning. Now again, I don't I you know, you know I don't do reviews if I have in a bottle. I don't do it. So I'm not gonna call this a review. I'm gonna call this a final observation. Final observation. That much I had. Yeah, some similar to it was in something like this. It was in something like this, I think. Maybe, okay? But I sprayed it all out. I went all out on it. I put some on my hands last night. You know what I mean? Just just to, you know, smell it throughout the night, see if it lasts throughout the morning. And uh yeah, I smelled it this morning. It wasn't strong. But you know, when you toss it and turn it all night and your, your hands underneath the pillow and all that stuff, you're going to lose it. But I'm telling you, I smell, I smell flavor all night long. Whether it rubbed off on the pillow or whatever. I'm telling you, it was decent. So, when I woke up this morning, I said, well, I'm just going to spray out the rest. And I sprayed out the rest. Now, fine. First five hours, everything was good. It was raining the day in Philly. Kind of chilly, but more moist. And when I work, I put I have to put gloves on and off because I'm doing stuff. So I put on my work gloves, and I would take off the work gloves because I'm like, ain't no way it's gonna be on my hands after I've been out here in the moisture. And I take the gloves back off, put them on, back off. Still there at the end of the day. Eight hours. Skin scent, but still there after moisture. Taking off gloves. Summertime. I'm telling you, it'll bang off. Now, let me tell you why it'd be nice in the wintertime, but not like wearing it during the day, but at night, 
Because once a breeze hits this, you got it. They got it. They got to kiss your neck. They got to want to hug you. Once the wind poof hits them in the face, and I'm talking about man and woman, bam, it's on a pop. I'm telling you. Oriental Boulant, don't sleep. Grab that. Irish ganache is discontinued. You may not be able to get that. That's another, that's another piece right there. Alright? But right now on four galons, Tank Imperial, Spirit Two Double Vanille, Coquine, and Angelique Noir. I would like to have Cure Beluga and Boyce Armani. Definitely. And then man, I, I want I want to eat. I want them two and I want Irish ganache and Oriental Brulat. Gotta get that. It's gotta be on the list. I don't know how it's gonna happen. I don't know how it's gonna happen. 265 a bottle. I don't know, but it's, it's got to happen. I gotta have all eight. Gotta, those, those by eight. Now I'm gonna tell you, there's another sleeper in a whole nother other series they have. I don't know it's called the Orient series or something like that, but it's one called New York. It's really animalic, but it's sweet too. A little bit sweet, but it's more animalic than sweet. Man, I can't. It reminds me of Santal Blush a little bit with the animalic sandalwood, but New York is not really sandalwood, more it's animalic and something sweet. But that's, that's, that's a sleeper series right there. And like I said, New York, I, I didn't smell Moscow, or there was a couple other ones. But I'm telling you, check out that line. That line is cool. It's a little, it's not as expensive as the, uh, the art line, my the art and material line. But check out New York. I like New York. I didn't like Moscow. I think it was another Chinese one, something like that, an Asian one. I didn't really like that. I did like New York, though. So check that line out. If you're not familiar with that line and girl line, Check it out. Just type in girl line, type in New York. And then it should bring down all the rest that are in that particular line. I think they're about to discontinue that line, too, from what I understand. So if you want to get down with that, you better get up on it. Now, let's talk about what I had on for this evening. One of the sexiest bottles. When I saw this bottle, I just wanted this flavor because of the bottle. All right? Olivio Giabetti. Or Giabetti? Giabetti? Olivia? Olivia, Olivia, Adal Luban. Let me tell you something about it. It's creamy. It, it, it kind of reminded me of Memoir Woman or vice versa, because I like Memoir Woman as well, which is another creamy scent, somewhat boozy. Um, and, and, you know, it, it just has that flavor. It's definitely boozy. And if I'm not mistaken, uh, we have some booze in this. Yes, we do. I think it's called Ar -a la Rum. If I'm not mistaken, I think it's rum. Let me read the notes to you. Let me read the notes to you. All right, you ready? The opening consists of rum, sa rum, saffron, black cumin, and bitter orange. The heart follows with a chorus of dome palm, smoked ebony, aluminum, incense, and sugar cane. Okay? And the base features leather, red amber, lanthanum, and sandalwood. Very, it's such a complicated scent. This this scent, you know, another scent that this kind of comes close to, just just knocking on the door of, that would be Creation E by Roger Dove. This knocks on that door, along with Men Warm Woman, because they're all thick and creamy. I like a thick, creamy scent. And that's that's what these those three remind me of. This one and, and Creation Eve and, and Memoir Woman. Creamy thick. And ooh, I would throw Ooda Leaf in there too as well. But none of these have really have the ood note. But if, if Ooda Leaf didn't have the ood note, that could throw Ooda Leaf in there as well as being a creamy, but it has chocolate and cocaya. So cocaya, so it's kind of different. But this with the rum and, and the blend, this blend is unbelievable. Most people say they smell the rum first, which you do. If you put it to your nose, you'll think it's alcohol. Like, you know, like the alcohol you would smell in like a, a, a toilet or a cologne. But it's really alcohol. This, this is rum out. Man, I don't know how much this I had left, but I, I've decanted some of this. Oh, I got I got about half a bottle left, so I'm done decanting this, by the way. So don't ask me for it. Don't even think y'all got it. No. Once I get down to 50% of any bottle that I have, decanting is over because the rest is for me. You have to wait till I buy another bottle of something else. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, Adal Lubin, get up on it. Mature, sexy scent. 
I will wear this again at night. This is a nighttime scent. This is not something you want to wear during the day. They're flip flapping around at work. If you have an office job, or you know, you picking up trash, or you driving trains, or you delivering mail, you know, whatever. No, none of those. Wait till you get off work, take your nice shower, and put this on. I dial Lubin. I'm telling you, you can't get no sexy into this. Well, you can. You can. But you can get as sexy with this as any of the other ones that I mentioned to you. And that's including Nasamato Pardon, which is another sexy one if you ask me. And Oud Wood. And, oh, man, a lot of them are sexy. You know what I mean? Santa 33. But once again, within the vein of creaminess, this, you, you would dig it. I'm telling you. Memoir Woman, you would dig that. Even if you're a dude, you would dig Memoir Woman because the same vibe. And if you like Creation E, you got Roger Dove Creation E, you would like Ida Lubin. Easily. No doubt about it. Okay. So now, let's get to the surprise that came in the mail today. Because I wasn't expecting anything at all. And I just went to check out my regular mail and bam, this was in the mail box. So let's uh, open up this box. Let's see what we have in here. Ah. Sort of a big box, okay. Okay. Yes, I'm using a screw instead of some kind of true cutting apparatus because I really don't feel like getting back up and getting anything else. You know what I mean? I feel like just open it right from here, okay? I'm gonna crack this open. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. These are Ariats, and these are, the, the, the color is peanut, and these are called spot hogs. Actually, I'm not even supposed to have these. They're not even supposed to be here. Actually, I told them to, um, I tried to catch them and told them to send these back, because uh, you guys may have seen my boots, and uh, yeah, these shipped directly from uh, Ariat. Wow. Yeah, you guys see my boots, and uh, I like those boots better, but let's crack these open. You guys can check them out. <laughs> I took my man on to these, and he was like, man, he went and bought them. The same day I showed him the picture, he went and bought these bad boys. I like these, but to be perfectly frank with you, I really don't need any more shoes. Unless they need more boots, and um, also need to be spending more money. <laughs> Got enough shoes. I mean, I spend enough money. But here they are, right here. They must give you the vibe of uh, um, Uggs, in a sense. But you look at them like that, they look kind of Uggish. They look like they would be really cool, really comfortable. I don't know. Um, I don't know, man. I, I don't know. I mean, I don't know if I want to want to keep these. Here's a sole, which I think is almost like the same sole I have on the boots. He had an Ariat crest. Okay, so he's definitely some winter pieces. Black stitch, and that's true stitching, y'all. That is true stitching. That's not that's not that stitching that you'll find on um. Look at that. That's thread. It's not that painted on looking stitching that you'll find on 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 less superior shoes that's actual stitching on these shoes okay and again the company's called Ariat. i'm telling you i wore my i wore my man you know i never i never thought i'd come to the party i remember when i was a uh, single and um i was meeting women and they was, you know they would ask you questions like what kind of shoes you wear and stuff on these dating sites and what kind of how you dress and that particular time you know i'm just yo, know, all i wear tims you know what I mean? And you got some women talking about, I don't, I don't, I don't want to mess with a man that uh, uh, you wear Timberlands. I'm like, are you stupid or something? Because who don't wear Timberlands? I mean, you gotta, we ain't got to wear them every day. I ain't say I wore them every day. Look at this. This company as well. I know what that is. Lucky Flowers Anti-Mold Sticker. Wow, that's crazy. Ariat is a real thorough company. I'm telling you, the company is just off the chain. I mean, their presentation box, 
how they wrap the wrap your 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 toe wears. Well, I call them toe houses. The way they wrap your toe houses up. I'm telling you, it's, it's really nice. It's a really nice boot. And then like my other boots, they give you the cards. So I got to register the other boots. And uh, congratulations on the purchase of your Ariat footwear. At Ariat, we take pride in everything we make. We trust that you'll be happy with the quality and workmanship of our products to qualify for our warranty program and tell you how to list your boots. Put your boots on the warranty. Why would you put boots on the warranty? I don't know. But what shoe company that you put their boots in the warranty? I tell you right there. Real thorough company. So, anyway, that's what we have. But unfortunately, I will not be keeping these. I will be uh, sending them back. Because, uh, like I said, I ordered both boots. And I thought they would come at the same time. But uh, they did come at the same time. So, they didn't give me a chance to make a choice. But when, once the cowboy boots came to Ariats, they're called Radcliffe's. Once the red clips came, and I put them on, like I said, I wore them at night. Man, them my new Tim's right there. Those are my new Timblers. Them boots, all right? So, let's, let's lock it up for the night. Let's call it night. I got to get ready to bounce, all right? Football game is on. Six is probably getting their butt kicked by San Antonio. Orange juice in the glass. Eyedow looping on the skin. Uh, Oriental Brulon by Girlon. Grab you some. All right, and uh, ride a real deep, cool CD back there. That's the CD called Official. The name of that song is called Tonight. All right, and uh, I think about it. I don't know what else to tell you. I, I can't tell you nothing I haven't told you before in any other video. You know what I mean? And if you checked out my video via, the, via my, my, my camera phone this morning, my camera video, go check that out on my page. That's on my Roger B. Smelling Good page. It's deep. It's what I feel. Honest assessment of how I'm being assessed. And like, no, I ain't saying me, but I'm just saying. I was just rapping. You know what I'm saying? So if you want to check that out, check that out. Check out, stay up on my page. Keep up with the Roger page, too. You know what I mean? That's a decent dude. The musician guy, the guy who plays guitar and all that stuff. That's a nice guy. Check him out, too. All right, so let's go ahead and lock this up and put away the key. Lock it. Pull it back. Where the key at? Man, I lost the key, man. I'm always losing the keys, man. I lost the key. But we're going to be out of here anyway. Ride the Real Deep Cool. Thank y'all for stopping by. Thank you for the comments. Thank you for people still subscribing. Share with other people. If you feel like it, you know what I mean, I'll keep bringing you videos. I'll keep bringing you scents you may not have smelled before. i keep it pushing. I got some other stuff here. You know what I mean? I got, I got some stuff right here. Dolce Gabbana. You know, we'll get back on there another time. But uh, in the meantime, I'm out. I got the bounce. I am gonna try on the boots though. <laughs> Just to get the change my mind, right? I'm out. Peace. Have a great night. Sleep well. And remember, and all you do, keep it heavenly. I'm out. Bars.